Now that I'm using Cloud 3.5 Sonnet a lot more, along with ChatGPT 4.0, I'm needing to transfer my prompt from one platform to the other, and I found that a bit annoying. So I created myself a little bit of a Chrome plugin, like a custom-made plugin uh, that I've got here, and all it does is just saves my prompts um, that I can put in here and name, and then I can copy it, and then that automatically copies to my clipboard, and you can see here, I can paste it and I can start using it in uh, Cloud AI and Thropic, or I can even do it in ChatGPT as well. Let me start a new conversation here. It's already pasted, it's a massive prompt. It makes, it turns any language model into a bit of an SEO expert. It's a lot of fun. Uh, if you want access to that, you can um, get access to it in our online community, uh, the AI Ranking Automation Hub. But I just wanna show you that I created this plugin and you can create a plugin as well with Claude 3.5 Sonnet. It is amazing. Like, and it's a simple prompt and you can create plugins, you can create web apps, you can create all sorts of things now because 3.5 Sonnet is so ridiculously good at coding and understands what you want, even if you don't know how to explain yourself, that you can create little web apps and plugins like, uh, like we're gonna do right now, I wanna show you. So, so the instructions for it to create the plugins are pretty simple. Uh, here, create a Chrome extension that's called Prompt Saver that allows the user to save, view, copy, and delete a frequently used prompt. The extension should have the following features, pop up, yada, yada. I didn't even know how to what all the features that it needed, but I asked ChatGPT to give me the features of what I think my uh, plugin would need. And then I'm giving this to Claude 3.5 Sonnet and in one shot, it'll give me all the files that I need to then upload to Chrome. You'll need the developer version. I'll show you how to do that. And then you have a custom pop-up that will do everything that you need to do. If you've ever had an idea for a Chrome extension, a little plugin, uh, that you wanted to build yourself, but you never could because you don't know how to code, well, now you've got no excuse because Sonnet 3.5 from Anthropic is free now. Um, so go and test it out. So now it's given me uh, the one, two, three, four files. Now with this, with a pop-up, you also need two additional files that it won't give you, but it's just uh, two PNG files. One needs to be 120, 128 by 128 pixels, and the other one needs to be 48 pixels, uh, and that's it. So I have, what you need to do is you need to download these files. To download them, you, for example, click the manifest file and you click this download button. And you need to make sure that you download all the files into one folder and name that folder appropriately. I've got pop up uh, there and I've got the style CSS. Cool. So I've got them all now downloaded and I'll show you. In this folder here, uh, I've got the manifest, the pop-up, uh, the styles, the CSS, and then the icons. The icon's really simple, it's just these two things here, right? All you need to do now is just go to your, and it tells you, gives you all the instructions. Um, oh, if you don't know, you can ask it, where do I upload this thing? And it should give you like step-by-step -step instructions. The reasoning of Claw 3.5 is just on another level. I've got here extensions, so I need to go to here to be able to upload my custom uh, Chrome plugin. I'm gonna copy, go to extensions. You need to have developer mode on because now you're a developer. <laughs> uh, otherwise you can't upload it. So for example, that here, and you're gonna go uh, load unpacked and you're going to click on your folder containing all of the files. You're gonna go select, and now you've got your Chrome extension enabled. You just need to uh, go and make sure you've got it pinned. So I've got my prompt saver pinned here, and now it does everything that I want it to. So let's create a simple prompt here, like uh, generate a meta description. One thing that I'm always using is creating a meta description out of a blog for clients. Perfect, uh, and then meta description mega. So I've named it, uh, I'm gonna save the prompt, and now you can see that it's saved here. So if I go to copy and I go to ChatGPT or Claude and uh, paste it there, my prompt is my prompt is saved like I wanted to, and I've got a really cool, neat, custom Chrome plugin. It's amazing. If you want the plugin yourself, because you might want this, I'll leave it in the description of the links below. And if you wanna learn how to use all these AI tools to rank your website number one in Google, to do automations and general marketing stuff, I recommend you check out our community. Uh, I'll leave it in the description below, but it's called the AI Ranking and Automation Hub, just teaching you how to go through all these things. And you have uh, live sessions with myself, but 
If you haven't checked it out, Claude Sonic 3.5 is on another level. I won't release it in the Chrome store because I don't want to go through all that. So you'll have to upload the whole folder just as I showed you there. So you have to download it and then upload it yourself. Um, if you don't know how to do that, ask Claude 3.5 because it is amazing. And uh, yeah, I hope that helps. If you want me to build another Chrome extension using Claude AI, leave it in the comments. I'd love to hear what you want to see me build next. Cheers.